on YouTube is IJI Talks, and today I'm gonna be doing a um a product haul for you guys, a hair product haul for you guys. Um, I'm gonna be showing you guys the products that I use now and products that I used to use back when I had my ass curl. Um, this might this might seem like a lot of stuff, but like it's not because I used to have like way more than this. But this is the stuff that I just have sitting in my room. That I thought I should show you guys and if you guys it might work for you guys because it worked for me at the time and some of it works now so I'm gonna start off with showing you guys my favorite um, shampoo that I use it's um the Tresemme Naturals shampoo basically um, any Tresemme shampoo will um, work for me um, I tried other shampoos but like they they didn't really work for me the same thing with conditioners they didn't work for me but I'm gonna stay in the shampoo for now but it's the um Tresemme shampoo this is the one that I picked up because I, I like trying different Tresemme as long as, long as it's Tresemme I'll try it because Tresemme is like a really good brand anything Tresemme is most likely that I'ma buy it and I hate when people say like that's for like white people because it's not so so yeah this is my shampoo and I'm gonna show you guys another shampoo that I use that's not Tresemme but my phone right here. But here, that's right here. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yes. This shampoo I only really use when um when I use this. I only use this when I um used to um texturize my hair. I, I would use this like right after when I texturize my hair. But I haven't used it in a while because I texturized my hair like a while ago. So other people in the house been using it. So yeah, that's that. And this is the other shampoo. I don't, I don't like, I don't like this shampoo. But let me show you guys the name though. This shampoo like disappointed me. It's some, it, it, it's like it didn't clean my hair the way that I wanted it to. Like I wanted to strip it. And it says it has, it says that it has sulfate in it. And I guess that's supposed to help clean your hair. But this didn't. It smells good though, but I heard good reviews about this on YouTube, and I'm thinking like it's gonna it, like it will work for me because like I seen a lot of like guys, African American guys say this worked good on their hair, but this didn't work for me, and the conditioner really upset me because it didn't moisturize my hair at all. So it's either the the humectant moisture one didn't work for me or none won't work. But I know that I'm not gonna try it because I like Tresemme too much, but. Yeah, this didn't work for me, and this is like a full bottle, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I'll probably just give it to my aunt since she's like still in all my hair stuff anyway. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys my conditioner that I use, my favorite brand, Tresemme. And the reason I got two bottles is because um, I ran out of this one, the True Moisture. Any Tresemme conditioner um, I can use because I do my deep conditioner with these. So, yeah, I'm out of that one. So I just really got this one. This is the um, Topical softness, softness Conditioner for um, dry, brittle hair, smooth and silky. And you see, this is like full because I only use this one time. And when I do my deep conditions, I use like a lot of conditioner because me, when I put product in my hair, I like to like feel it, especially if I'm like gonna be like leaving it in for a while. So yeah, I use like a lot. So this bottle like will last me for like around like another it won't even last me a month because I like to use it a lot really but I like Tresemme so I don't mind paying the price so what else and okay I'm gonna start showing you um oh wait this is another shampoo that really really disappointed me so bad and I only got this shampoo at the time because I just had dyed my hair brown and I thought that this shampoo would be perfect because I didn't want my color to fade that fast when I washed my hair. So I went out and bought the um, Garnier Fruit Tees Color Shield Shampoo. Color treated. So yeah, that it, that it is. This stuff <laughs> didn't work for me at all. And I guess, like, I don't know. I guess it was my hair type. And I probably, it probably was my hair type because this didn't work for me at all it didn't make my color fade but the conditioner sucked it was just like the humectant it's like they, they don't they didn't do anything for me so this is a full bottle again that i didn't use 
and I didn't pay a lot of money for this because I got this at um, CVS and it was on sale. And so I was thinking that because I didn't buy it, somebody bought it for me. So yeah, I'm probably just gonna give these away. Not online though, to somebody in the family because I don't know how to do that shipping stuff. Um. Okay, now I'm gonna start showing you guys the products that um I used to use. Well, no, not that I. Well, yeah, the ones that I used to use when I had short hair. So when I had um when I start first started growing my hair, I was really big on um, hair lotions. I didn't like oils or greases because I couldn't feel them in my hair. My hair was like really short. I couldn't feel them. So I always stuck to hair lotions. I always stuck to hair lotions. So this is the um, hair lotion that I always stuck with that moisturized my hair really good. It was the um, Can Do Can Do Shea Butter Moisturizer. You guys can see that. And yes, this stuff is all gone. I don't know how because I haven't used it in a while, but again, my aunt's been in my stuff again. <sighs> but yeah, I didn't use it anyway, so it's cool. But yes, this is stuff I used to use. And if you have short hair and you're looking for really good moisturizer, use a hair lotion. You don't have to worry about oil and crap because hair lotion is way better than that if you have short hair. Well, for me anyway, because oil didn't, my hair sucked oil right up. But now that I have long hair, I stick with oil because for some reason it helped so much and I don't feel like putting like that hair lotion in my hair now that I have long hair. So oil is like the easy alternative for that. So this is the oil I use. Don't pay attention to the label because this is not the um, oil that's in, in here. This is actually um, olive oil, extra virgin olive oil and I only put it in this bottle because of this tip right here. And I get braids a lot now, so I put this in my hair, and olive oil is like the best thing I heard, and I know for sure that works because I use it on my hair. Because I use it on my hair, so yeah. Olive oil is the best, and I heard some of our grapeseed oil, coconut oil, but I haven't tried those yet because I have olive oil. What else? Okay, so this is the grease. I don't use a lot of grease. You guys probably already know that. And this thing, like, I bought this. And it's, like, still, like, still, like, full. Well, not full because other people in the house use it. I keep this in the bathroom. The products that, like, I don't really want and I, like, don't like, I keep them in the bathroom because I know everyone's, like, going to use it. But my products that I use a lot, I keep them, like, in my room, like, on my shelf because I don't want people to use them because they use them all. Cause it seems like they don't use hair products when like I don't buy them, but when I buy them, everyone wants to use it. So I keep my stuff in my room. But this is the Do Grow um, Do Grow Medicated Hair Vitalizer Triple String Grease. I use this when I um when I use this. I don't remember using it. I think I just bought it just because it was on sale. Because when I first started growing my hair, I should buy a bunch of products just because they were there and I had the money. But, yeah. I don't use this, so this is going right back in the bathroom after. Yeah. So, there's that. Alright. I think. Okay, no. Oh my god. I have not used <laughs> I have not used this stuff. She's been in this for real. She might be able to take off. Oh. Okay, so this is my leave-in sleek and shine instant smooth conditioner. I can I can say this leave-in conditioner works really good, and I'm actually like glad that it's almost magically gone because I'm going out today and I'm buying the um, can to shea butter leave-in conditioner today, and I'm gonna guard that with my life because my aunt's not using that. But yes, this is. The um, leave-in conditioner I used to use, and um, as I got further in my hair journey, I actually like, stopped buying a lot of hair products, and because I used to think when I first started that products was gonna make my hair grow, until I finally learned that products don't make your hair grow. So yeah, I kind of slowed down with buying the products. So that's why, yeah. So it did what it, it did what it said on here: dry, it stopped from being dry, frizzy, it wasn't frizzy. And manage manageable hair. So yeah, I used to use the stuff when my hair was my hair was wet. I like um applying product to my hair when it's wet than like when it's not wet but like damp. I don't like really like doing it to damp hair because I don't really feel like it helps. 
the only thing that I would probably say uh, damp hair is probably um oil. I mean dry hair is probably oil. But yeah, that's my leave-in conditioner. But that's the last time you guys will see this because I'm not gonna buy it again. It's good, it's really good, but I'm not gonna buy it again because I'm going I wanna try the cam too for now. So yeah. And so now I can show you guys the products that I used to use when I had my um my S curl. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys that really really helped me like so much with keeping my curls like good and shiny and straight is two products. First, I'm gonna show you the first product that, that you probably would, like will never think that I would use, but it's the Tresemme Tres Tres Two hairspray. Yeah, firm control. So yeah, that's that. When I had my when I had my S curl, I wanted my curls to like stay like stay in place. And this Tresemme hairspray, Tresemme is like the best and everything. So I love them. It smells so good. Tresemme, I used to use this. I like hold it away from my head and I would like spray it like on my like around my head like really like not a lot because I don't want my like curls like hard. But that's why you hold the further you hold away. Further you hold it away, the less you get on your hair and the, like the soft, softer your curls will be, but they will still stay. But if you wear that hard stuff, you get like right in there and spray it, trust me, it's gonna stay. So yeah, that's what I used to use for my curls and it helped so much. It didn't damage my hair, it didn't break my hair off. It washed right out really fast and it smells really good, so that's a plus. And this is my, I had, this is the one I was using this one first, the Trez, um, Trez 4. But it was too strong, so I went down to the Trez 3, and this is the one that I stuck with with my ass curl. But, so now I don't have an ass curl anymore, so I don't need my hair stiff, so I don't use these two anymore. So, yeah. And, um, another alternative that I used to use when um, I didn't want to use hairspray. Well, I used to use both of these. The um, Tresemme holding gel and the um, hairspray, because the holding gel was an um, will hold my hair and make it shiny, and just like keep that hold for me. And but like this hold wasn't strong as like the hairspray, so I would use these both in my hair, and it wasn't like a lot of buildup or gunk in my hair when I used these used it too, because I used a really really small amount of this gel because I had um two different other girls. I had the regular S curl gill to like get my curls in there and scuff the curls. But then I had this to um, hold it and then I used the hairspray to like lock it in place. But yeah, I didn't have any build up because I didn't use a lot of these products. That's one thing I didn't do in my hair. I didn't use like a lot of products because I didn't want that, that gunky feeling. So yeah. And, na, 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 and what add shines to my, what add a shine to my hair. And my my S curl looks so good all the time. I took the tag off, but the Tresemme Tread no, it's not a Tread. Tresemme Sleek. I think it was Tresemme Sleek and Shine Sheen Spray. See this stuff? You can see the consistency of it. You can, it looks like really glossy, and like it made my curls look really glossy and clean and perfect. When I had my S curl, I. I I had like a really good S curl. If you don't believe me, go watch my S curl video. My first um, hair video I posted on my page. It's a picture of, um, not a picture, but a video. The thumbnail is a picture of me holding my head down with my curls. This did wonders. So if you want your curls to like stand out and like look sleek, shiny, get this. It helps so much. Yeah. So that's basically all I have to show you guys for now. And I'll probably have another updated hair haul sometime in the future, but not with these products because a lot of these products now that I like pick them up for the first time in forever, they're empty and like they're going in the trash. So that's it. I hope you guys like like this video and subscribe, rate, and follow me on Twitter at Ian Colors. That's E I A N C U L L E. E-N-S. Alright. Bye, guys.